Now, I've been working on the design of this thing for over a year, and well, things are shaping up pretty well, but this is my set of plans, and you'll notice a few changes are taking place. Now, most of the notes you see on here are things that were changing a little bit here and there, but unfortunately, there's a slightly larger change that's taking place on the roof. We've tried to keep as much of the original house intact as possible and very few changes have taken place upstairs other than a few new walls to establish a couple closets and kind of restructure the existing bathroom. Also, since we have no windows right now, it gives us great access to the roof. This is the roof over the new part of the kitchen as well as the brand new back porch we're creating. And you'll notice that the pitch on this roof is a little lazier than we have on the house and the other addition that we built. The reason for that is we were limited on how high we could go with the roof because of the size of that bedroom window. Now, we could put a smaller window in, but you want as much as natural light into that room as you can get. Plus, it's a code issue. You have to have a certain size window in a bedroom like that to allow a family member to escape in the case of a fire. So we can't go any smaller there, but I'll tell you, this really looks bad from this elevation because it looks like a flat roof. And it just loses something with all of this nice steep pitch roofs on either side of it. So what I've decided to do, it's gonna cost a little money, is to move that window over and that will allow this roof to pitch up much steeper and tie back in to the same lazier roof over there. That way, from this side, you'll be able to see shingles all the way along here, and I know it'll look a lot better. But this kind of demo is never any fun. Because it was just built, this roof doesn't want to come apart very easily. Yeah, go ahead and cut all these down, then we'll cut the hanger off. Okay, cut the hanger off. The new roof with a steeper pitch starts with a new ridge that will run from the house over the breezeway to the garage. Then the guys will fill in the rafters with the new angle on the street side before tying the other side into the lazier pitch of the porch roof. Once they cover it with decking, we're back in business and just in time since our good luck with the weather has finally taken a turn.